Might, might, might. You never know. Might be able to do it. <laughs> Home sweet home. Greedy fish eats all of the ones about. He should be, be the most superpower of them all, right? With how much bread he ate. He isn't thinking about them. He's just thinking about all that delicious fish. Food. The breads. <laughs> Not the other fish. <laughs> Even though he probably does eat other fish. And then, like, he sees the goldfish and then goes, yum, yum. Ice cream. Okay, so we needed to flood this whole level before. So we don't turn into puffer fish anymore. We grab things to bite goldfish. There was a box of goldfish, but they probably mean the foods. Yeah. Time to get off. Okay. Flooded the floor. Flooded the floor. <laughs> Took a little longer than first anticipated. Right. Needs. This drawer open to get next level. Yum, yum, yum. Chomp. Come on, chomp it. Stop trying to chomp it and chomp it. Oh, how was that not? <laughs> how are you failing at this? Doesn't want it enough. He just doesn't want it enough, does he? There we go. There we go. Flood some more. And then we got this dishwasher to get in. It opens even though it's not fully flooded. <laughs> Almost just straight onto the cheese board. Why are you so bad at this crowd up? <laughs> Why are you so bad at this crowd up? There we go, got it. Right, yak that off, get some more water. There's some tonic water up there as well. Dilly! Then... Hammer time. Or sandwich time. Because <laughs> surely that's made of the fancy bread, right? <laughs> That should be a secret slice of bread, if you ask me. That should be secret bread. <laughs> okay, then we got the cars. The cars will be fine. The cars didn't cause the ambient occlusion of doom. Last time, but now that I'm saying things, we more than likely will curse it. All the cars did was smash the car. Screw! <laughs> Get out of there! Well, I mean, he lived. <laughs> but at what cost? At what cost? Go, 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 go. Steering. <laughs> yeah, no. Aim perfectly for the tire. Like, my aiming of avoiding is just extra prepared for smashing. <laughs> Maybe if I just aim for the tire deliberately, we won't hit it. <laughs> you know? Just trying to aim to avoid them certainly isn't working, is it? Okay. Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> inside the car. <laughs> Just a nice lift to somewhere. But not freedom. Right, avoid it. That's on that side, you idiot. <laughs> yeah, no, I was like, the next car will surely be on this side of the road, it wasn't. It was not. Okay, that van is on that side. The green car is also on that side, right? That's two on that side. That's three on that side, you dirty... Dirty trick! <laughs> but we're spawning them all on that side of the road so that you will have a convenient time and be able to avoid them. No, that's not how it works. This is a camper van of doom! It didn't come on this side of the road, but this one is. Quickly, 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 quickly. <laughs> okay, now I just need to get in here before we get run over. <laughs> quickly. Before any more cars come on this side of the road. Although if we do get run over, at least we can flop to the checkpoint. Okay. So. Last time we went left. And we ended up with the ambient occlusion of doom. I mean, obviously we do need to eventually go to the same seagull land, but. Maybe. We get wedged on a brick. <laughs> if we get wedged on a stupid pebble of the scenery. Instead. <laughs> we can uh, avoid that. <laughs> yep, that'll definitely do it. If you get stuck on the scene and never progress, that'll definitely prevent it from breaking. No, but if we come this way, it may be manipulating the RNG. These people are so loud. <sighs> Maybe they'll spawn things differently. And we'll have better luck. I hear seagulls of doom. I hear the seagulls of doom calling our name. Obviously, this path doesn't go get the wonder bread. But it does just go. <laughs> right, there's the wonder bread. Don't care. All I care about is actually just finishing the game <laughs> at this point without it breaking. Oh, there is a special bread of its own over here. Hey. No! Uh, I have a cunning plan. <laughs> I think we might be a little pickled here. <laughs> we got ourselves in a little bit of a pickle. You know, ignore the spinning <laughs> bottle. That is perfectly natural. Okay. Carefully. Skirt. Fuck 
kid. <laughs> okay, the spinning bottle when it spawns in is questionable and dangerous. It means the physics of the engine is wonking. It lands nicely. Is she swimmy against the death? Don't over pickle it this time. Okay, good. Now, seagulls. How am I meant to quietly contemplate down here? By contemplation? Actually, no, this is seagull lands. Fuck. Hello? Hello? Yes. Damn it! Get out of there before you get seagulls! That's fine. Just gotta dodge the seagulls. This is not fine. Okay, just gotta dodge the seagulls. We close. Go 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 Two hits is not. Okay, go, 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 go. You coming. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. Okay, now just race for the checkpoint against the pigeon of doom. He says, not hitting the chair. Go, 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 go. Oh, you... Uh, we're doomed. Let's get the checkpoint. Come on. Yes! <laughs> okay. We defeated the Seagull of Doom. Now we have... Not worth it. Where do we go from here? I'm going to assume this way. You assumed poorly. Now that's an interesting bug. Respawning respawns us without our thing exactly where we were already stood that wasn't a checkpoint. That is a curious bug. Right, so if it's not that way, it's got to be this way. Right, don't get hit by Seagull of Doom. That's a very interesting mechanic. <laughs> okay, so I'm not seeing any plausible way to go, although there is a big old lake. Maybe we just go in the big old lake. Maybe we smash it deliberately and fall into big old lake.
In which case, we are going over that way. Eventually. <laughs> Cut those deer things, they will kill fish. So we're going to deliberately smash off the edge. At some point. Once I get my three point turn in. Because there's no other way. That makes sense. And then we just flop towards the river. That's too far. That is way too far. Yep, not in that. Hmm. Like the boxes? Maybe there's something I can use inside of the boxes. Like this guy can fight things. But I'm not really seeing anything bite-worthy. Right. Oh. Hidden path. Don't you dare. Hey, that's Keaton. Ready? Right, we're just gonna respawn. Which again, interesting mechanic, but it's not intended. Okay. But these boxes were here just to hide the actual path. Come on. Keep moving. Get under the table at least. On. Stupid. <laughs> Four pack. <laughs> That's just because the things hitting us can cause the ambient occlusion of doom. That I don't want to do that. Get in here and smashed. Thankfully, that's not... Just don't curse it. Get in there! Get in there. Come on, get in there before he comes. Right. <laughs> you should not be level 4 alert. That was... Come on. Under the table where you can't see him. Really... This is a challenging turn and we have like one hit left. Go, 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 go. Where's he coming from? That's fine. Go, 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 go. Move, move, move. Okay, still now it's one hit left. Eight, he missed. Doomed. <laughs> Absolutely doomed from the outset, right? The bread is plausible, but I'm not going for it. No. Either or. Either or. <laughs> Just don't dink us in the middle of nowhere. Right, okay, he's not coming for us. If he is, he's a dirty cheater. Because <laughs> I'm under the table. Okay, good. <laughs> right. 
straight on till morning. But it's probably not the greatest move, is it? Like, doing a full turn like that. Like, go, 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 go. Damn it! It's fine. Not fine. Not fine at all. <laughs> okay, we lived. Go, move, 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 move. He's coming straight for you. The water has gone a little red. Move. Quickly, quickly, quick. What? <laughs> go, 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 go. Move. Get a move on. To the table. Straight on till morning. Okay, we did it. <laughs> Out of one lot of seagulls. They are on amber alert still, it seems. Even though we're surely protected. <laughs> Surely protected. Come on. Okay, we've got rid of the alert. Obviously, the jar's in a little bit of a pickle. Right. On the thing. Oh. No. Yeah. On the thing. That's not on the thing. <laughs> and that's also alerting seagulls, right? Three, two, one. That's nice and straight to get on the thing. That's not on the thing. <laughs> okay. This is perfectly lined up. He said that last time. But this time he meant it. <laughs> okay. Out of seagull lands. Even though there do seem to be seagulls circling to the lake. No. <laughs> right. Surely this is freedom. Of level one, at least. It's got to be the finishing line of the level. Come on. You're there. It does not want to appear to go that way. <laughs> Just break dancing. Breaking and dancing. To celebrate. Okay, this way, this way, this way. Keep the momentum. Nice little teapot and off the flower pot. Ah! Uh, <laughs> it was all a dream! We were in a sink in a bathtub all along. I guess we were never meant to make it, and that's why it slowed down. As for how we ended up in a bathtub... Your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> your guess is as good as mine. Because... It sounded like a seagull somehow grabbed us. Uh, appearances are deceptive. Right, radiator. <laughs> appearances are deceptive because it certainly looked like we made it to the lake. <laughs> it certainly looks that way. Toilet flush? But 
but probably need to clog it. The towel? What? Books? Can't grab the books. The whey protein? Or am I just flushing myself? Please stop clogging the toilet! Big hint hint. And I get it, you want me to clog the toilet with summer, but with what? I not flush myself. Now I've clogged the toilet. <laughs> in a little bit of a trouble in the toilet. There we go, right. Ah. Toilet roll. Already soggy toilet roll. Pink soggy toilet roll. Whole roll of it. Okay. Now it's flooded. <laughs> Even though the flooding of the room would surely also make the toilet roll into the thing. Would surely also make the toilet roll float up and out of it. You asked me. I am so good at these jumps. <laughs> I guess they're pink. Wow, well, almost glitched into the thing. To demonstrate that they're a grabbable thing. Sink destroys. So the shower! <laughs> Is the door just open? Oh. I do need to open that. It's very clean. And it's the sort of glass that you can't see. Exists. Nailed it. <laughs> Also, that's a, like, a drain right there. You'd think I'd have to clog that as well. Eagle? Steven? Time to get revenge! Time to get revenge. You take me away. Thank you. I know I should be letting go right about now. <laughs> we did it! He obviously deposited us in there, right? Because how else did we just randomly fly into the bathtub? <laughs> From our victory, we were snatched. We were snatched. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, fishy time. It is time to be fish. So we must have swam all night. Just a little piranha out to get a bite to eat. What are we eating? More seagulls, because they doom the game. <laughs> I don't want to interact with them, but if we can eat them, then, you know, few less seagulls around the world. No one surely is going to have a go at that. There was probably bread the other way, but at the end of the day, we're just escaping. If we can find a way out of here. What is that?
radioactive bottle? Just an empty water bottle? <laughs> Big open world to explore. Sadness. Alright, this weird rock with blooming stuff. Aha. Flowers? This seems like the way to go to the Perna's Rock. We need to make our way through the woods. Okay. Path! Secret path. Unimpressed fish path. <laughs> Hello. Just eating the walls. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Let's go. Don't die. <laughs> Stuck in the spawn of the room transition. Under. Under's fine. I don't need to jump it. <laughs> okay, I see Brad. Okay. Swinging on vines, huh? Clever. <laughs> New mechanic. Swing on vines. I feel like the bread vine was a lot shallower. Like, not as obvious as these, but it, I did see it. Also, like, <laughs> whilst that is fun, there's also just walk around it. <laughs> okay, so red flowers mean... Thing that you can bite, but not as obvious. All things to bite. Come on, let me in. Let me in. There we go. That's good enough. Get in. Well, that's out the way. You can fit through. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Don't need to remove every single piece of it. Another seagull. Take me away! Where are you going? This'll do. <laughs> This'll do. Yeah, definitely an interesting... Ooh, this is... This is a tough one. No! <laughs> okay, I bet he was going to take us to some fantastic breads. We don't need it. Or a really, really cool path. Oh, Seagull of Doom. Okay. <laughs> he didn't get as much of a jump as I thought he would there. I think I've got used to puffer fish and flying fish that could get a lot of height. Take me. <laughs> Wherever you go. It maybe let go a little too early because there was another bit of water right there, but we made it. I see my prey. I light up. I failed the jump. Because <laughs> these waterfalls are deceptive. Oh, come on. <laughs> Fine. We didn't need him anyway. Like, you know, we're just making our way out of here. <laughs> Whilst getting revenge on the seagulls is nice. It's not necessary. Okay. There we go. We made it. Any more seagulls? There's our prey. We get... You had to try and say it, didn't you? We're getting the ones that are necessary! And then he doesn't even grab it. <laughs> even though I clearly jumped and bit at it. It was like, nope, that don't count. We're getting the ones that are necessary. We might not be getting the extra special ones, but we're getting the ones that we have to. And then we don't. Fine. This is fine. Obviously... 
potentially other paths, but we go the way that we're given. <laughs> the way that presents itself to us. There is no wrong way. There's only the way that you take on the path you take in life. I grabbed that! Come on! Not that it was necessary because it's not going to do anything other than look cool, but I did grab that. <laughs> Okay. What are we doing here? Just going in? <laughs> going in. Help. Sibbles. I see big red thing to turn. But obviously that's going to be a future step. So where... In the ambient occlusion nightmare. It's the actual thing that we're doing in here. <laughs> okay. Not getting stuck inside of a cup that I didn't even see. Would be top priority. Not getting stuck inside a cup of doom. Not getting injected with death needles. This is not looking jumpable. Big old block of woods. Death cup. I'm not seeing <laughs> anything that we can do here. Like, obviously, if I can get in there. This is the checkpoint. Okay. Like they've clearly made that so high that that isn't the option. I mean, these aren't biteable because there's no reds. They are sucking us in. I'm not seeing any other valves. Nothing red, nothing. But it's obvious that we can jump to that, because we just did. Okay, woods. Woods. To clog the thing. Wood to clog the vent. Okay. We clog the suction. That should make it flood in here more. Right. If I clog it enough, it should flood in here more. Science. <laughs> okay, that one was a bit clever. That one was a little bit clever. He's not liking these vents much. Get off of it. 
Okay, now we just need to jump up to this. Or not. Maybe I need to clog both vents. Maybe I haven't clogged it enough. Any more? There is another word. Okay, <laughs> just get that thing off of me. Damn it. <laughs> Didn't see it till it was too late. Okay, this is an interesting way of biting this. I mean, it might be that we had clogged both. And that counted. But it might be that I need to double clog both. And then... It gets even higher. Okay, single clogging on both is not doing it. And that's a definite. Because we made sure that that was very clogged. Like, very clearly clogged. Okay. One doubled. And there was another piece of wood. Was. Where is it? Where's the other piece of wood gone? <laughs> like, I saw a fourth piece of wood last time. And I was heading to it when we got killed. Here it is. Hiding. Okay, avoid the death. Double clocked. There we go. Still pulling us in. Even though we clogged it. And then that gives us enough height to actually jump and grab this. He says. <laughs> It might be that I need to repeatedly grab and turn. It is a turn handle. Or just grab and, like, turn. Wait. Maybe not that way, maybe the other way. The other way. Obviously. <laughs> the way that it will turn. Okay. Hold it. Then... Still not dying to all the trash. There's another pipe to go in. But it might just be that the pipe is filling. Okay, this way is the way to go. We'll navigate past all of the doom. And then another pipe. Which way do you turn? That way. I'm not back again. My soul's back. Back again. Turning pipes. That soul's back again. Hey. Okay. More water! Curiosity! <laughs> Aha! Probably a little bit of bread somewhere. And this, while it's already underwater, makes this so much easier. More already completely submerged things that we probably don't need to care too much about. If we could add more and more water, it certainly makes life easier.
certainly makes life easier. This is one smart fish. Brett. So that's absolutely just to get the bread, isn't it? All those extra things. <laughs> just for that singular piece of bread. Okay. But if we've got an excess where we need to escape, that's not a problem if you ask me. This? Something? This looks like it's blocking way out. And I need to pull these to open it, if you ask me. But maybe, <laughs> if we're super careful and smart, I can't grab the needle and poke them and pop them. There goes that plan. I was like, maybe I can puncture them and they inflate if they're inflatable or something along those lines. I mean, the game didn't have an invisible wall. <laughs> I could just swim around that. But maybe there's something else we need to do. <laughs> maybe there is somewhere else we need to go or something else we need to do. Back down to the bottom. Nothing else down here. Death and demise. Like, that pipe definitely says to me, look at me, I'm a thing to escape through. I am the way. This says there's nothing up here. I'm just a piece of bread that you've already got. Obviously, we've opened all of the vents. There's nothing up here either. And that is the only thing. And it's not grabbable. This is clearly the exit. So what am I doing wrong? Eva? Not like there's a pipe there. There's nothing red on this. And I'm not seeing anything else red anywhere. But that is clearly exit pipe. I, if I find a way to defeat this, we get out. I doubt unclogging the airways of that does anything. This does not make sense. Like, clearly he's supposed to be able to interact with these. Why does he, like, act like there's no water there? It's the problem that I've put too much water. 
Is that actually the problem? <laughs> like, does this only work if there's no water? Because he's acting like I'm supposed to be jumping up to it with no water. Did that reduce the amount of water? <laughs> Like the way that he was bumping into them, it's like, yeah, this don't work with extra water. You're supposed to not have water when you're interacting with these. Okay, water coming back down. Even though it would make perfect sense to me that, you know, you could bite them. And yank them just the same. With or without water. With or without water. With or without water. Hey. Okay. Now there's less water. Ah. Ah. They float. Get off! Get off! Thirty. Keys, it's robbed. Eat it. Not that way. Why does he sound like a dog? Like an angry little poodle. Angry little poodle fish. Okay. So if we fill it too much, like, does it still count that I got that bread? I guess the only way that we know is going to be if I do the thing. But what I need to do is race it, hop in whilst it's still flooding up. The angry poodle fish. What I need to do is I need to get in there whilst it is still flooding upwards. Which means I will turn these on, but then I'll come back for them and turn the other ones at the front off and turn them back on to get in there at the same time with ones that are very, very close to it. So that it doesn't seal up, but it also might be that I don't need to seal the whole thing. Yep, the bread is back there. Okay, it's fine. We'll get the bread. Bread ain't that hard to get. And we'll turn all of these back down again at the front. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. You spin me right down like a windmill. But the lyrics it snap. <laughs> Ish red dot lights being weird. Okay, so they're floaty things, but at the same time, come on, like <laughs> obviously, if we. Didn't <laughs> what I can do
what would have made sense is if I could yank those wood away. I guess they're too ingrained in, right? Okay. We probably only need to turn one off. Let's face it. One is probably plenty and it doesn't even need to be raced to get in. It's probably like half open enough at that point. Or not. So what I need to do is take one more off and then race that one in. Whilst it's flooding. As well as this one is off, that's too low. Now you notice that the water doesn't seem to have filled up any higher. There's something curious about that. Is it because of the ordering? Damn it. <laughs> that was me trying to be clever. And maintain the momentum of the wheel. It just doesn't want to tick that extra tick, does it? It literally stops it. Come on, baby fish. <laughs> Okay, so that doesn't reduce it anymore, which is interesting. Ordering seems to be important. Yeah. Ordering. So if I reduce this now, It'll reduce even lower. Because of ordering. But if I can make this in time... I mean, it's not going to flood back in because of the one that I've taken, when, even if I do complete this one. Just because of ordering. But this will be ready to go. Yeah, that doesn't seem to have raised it, even though it made noise. Maybe it did raise it a bit. Can you swim down with it? Made noise, didn't move. But this all fully floods. We might have a bit more time when we do it. Oh no. 
Or not. Come on, you nasty little poodle. Okay, water going down. Okay, maybe that always just empties the lot to the bottom. Maybe I never need to touch anything else because this just always empties it to the bottom. Maybe I should turn off the last one. Maybe the last one's just too much. Get in. Let's go. Okay. Or we can just race it in and nail it. <laughs> Nope. That's all we can just make it. <laughs> that works too. Just getting in there perfectly also works too. Okay, let's go. For a moment. <laughs> I thought he was in trouble. Okay. Well, this seems problematic. <laughs> Help. 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 Before you get run over. <laughs> Got in the water. Okay. These potholes definitely need some work. <laughs> Just wait for the cars and go. Didn't wait for cars. <laughs> Almost got run over. That was your opportunity. Right. Into the pipe. Ow. <laughs> I think the car suffered a bit more than we did somehow. Somehow. <laughs> I mean, checkpoint to the left, but what is to the right? Nothing. <laughs> a dead end. Okay, this must be if you get caught by the cars as like a last resort to get back. Like, you know, if you got knocked a little too far down the road, you can always swim back up that pipe to get up here. Whoa. <laughs> oh, there's a roof. Right, okay. Aha, there's the bread. It's for secret bread. Secret. Secret bread. Greedy fish. On secret bread. <laughs> Probably should have got that before the checkpoint. Because now, like, if we die, we always have to go get that again. <laughs> but it's fine. It's fine. We can do that. This isn't that hard, he says, right? It's like Frogger, but we're a fish and we're trying to get in potholes. <laughs> in oncoming traffic, rather than just dodging the things, then, like, frogs can move across roads easier than a fish. <laughs> But he can survive getting run over. That's all good. Like, <laughs> unlike a frog, this guy can survive getting squished under a tire. <laughs> okay, now we just need to... That was the car. An opportunity. Pipe. Pipe. Be nothing to worry about. <laughs> Never a concern. But now what? To swim away? Bye cars! Nice knowing you, very polluted. Murillo! Is that like... Um... Esso? <laughs> uh, this game's version of Esso? Is that enough? Let me in. Thank you! 
I smell secret bread. I smell hidden bread. Like there's a whole maze of things, and of course, I go straight to the hidden bread. I don't know <laughs> if this is necessarily makeable. Out. There's a pipe. Of course there's a pipe. Of course there's a pipe. <laughs> the whole thing is we're meant to swim through the pipes and they're just ways to see. That would be backwards. <laughs> that would not be the way to go. That would be absolutely going backwards, right? But now we know. We want to come back into the pipe. Once we have at least these don't respawn. Once we've got the secret bread that I could smell, because we're a fish and we could smell the delicious bread. We'll just come back into the pipe system and swim through it. <laughs> sure, I could have made him bounce across the tarmac so that piece of a pothole. But at the same time, if there's a literal pipe towards it. Like literal pipe in the right direction. is better than questionable leap. I can't. Go, 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 go. Oh, there's more pipes. Get the checkpoint. <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> about the not taking the questionable leaps, it's a maze system. Whilst it looks like the head areas that we could leap between. We probably could, but it would make more sense to come back into the maze. Okay, so left maze is not the way. Bread. I don't need people to write down things or people to say, hey, you go left, right, left, 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 right, left, right, right, left. Because we can just memorize. <laughs> where it works and it's not that intricate of a maze even so you know and then to the right because it's on the there's a checkpoint there and then these are probably just to identify and look where you want to go although right that one we can definitely make it to absolutely make it to that one and the next one Once the cars are fast, there we go, that was a nice leap. One giant leap for fish kites. Now. Ah! Greg, isn't that? Greg Fisher? Oh no! In a car accident. We'll get you to Barnatcha General as soon as Not Greg! Hey, there's a fish here. Someone fill up a transplant <laughs> box with water for it. Don't let me forget. Don't let me forget. It looks like it's dying. Okay, so <laughs> that was an unexpected twist. <laughs> Just caused a car crash. Okay, so we're clearly going to end up at the hospital with Mr. Man. <laughs> old Greg. Good old Greg on his way to the hospital and not dead <laughs> I mean if you play them in this order surely he had to survive to be in the other ones right whereas when it's the last risk that you take there's the possibility of death isn't there oh no he's in burden simulator lands Let me out. <laughs> we're, 
That's different. <laughs> We're in a block of ice! Okay, it's not so much surgeon simulator as theme hospital right now. Okay. I mean, it's interesting that we're alive in this frozen block of ice. The local health service, not the NHS. Nice. With a heart. <laughs> a very questionable heart, but it's meant to be a heart. It looks a little artificial. Artificial. Okay, so <laughs> ice physics are a lot different to we have been used to. There goes the artificial heart. There is boxes in that side. <laughs> Carefully and safely we go down the cubes. Your positive experiences, yes. <laughs> so this is definitely theme hospital based. Like hospitals don't have this constant running on going. Maybe they did at some point in time, but not in any time that I've been alive. <laughs> or you know, gone to hospitals while being alive. Our ambulances are very we are melting. We're melting. <laughs> In the sun. Oh, that's a mechanic. <laughs> yep, that would make sense. The longer we're in the sun, the more our ice cube is going to melt. But we might have to melt it smaller. Because human fall flat. We had to melt things to the right size. I wouldn't be surprised if that's going to be a thing in this as well. Crunch your ice cubes. Remember to crunch your ice cubes. Nice little ice slalom. Any breads? Any delicious bread for a little trapped fish in ice? Help! 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 I'm melting! Hey. No longer melting. Re solidifying. <laughs> oh, it's because of the radiators as well. Ah, ha, ha. I was like, we weren't in the sun. Radiator. What? Get checkpoint. Then go check out the door. Because maybe there might be secrets in the door. My ice cube is getting a little thin. <laughs> and a little cracked. But I am curious. What on earth is that contraption? Okay. These are pushable doors. <laughs> and the fishes can push some remarkably strong objects at times that you wouldn't think they could. I see a hammer. I wonder if the halogen lights also emit heat. Probably. <laughs> Naturally they would, but do they in this game? To melt ice. To the slalom number two! Don't get too cracked. Don't let it impact too hard. Okay. We're on someone's table. Probably certain simulator. This is the certain simulator start menu. <laughs> this absolutely is the Surgeon Simulator start menu with the bonus discs of Boom, Unity, a mouse, don't... Don't fall off the desk. Because <laughs> you'll have to respawn. Okay, this is fine. Okay, so... Obviously, Greg's getting Surgeon Simulated. And probably needs a new heart. <laughs> or a new brain. Or some sort of questionable device that isn't. Like an apple, instead. That'll keep him alive. Nice little apple. Okay, onto the table. Mr. Ice Cube. Onto the chair. 
Because caring is caring. And then on to the nice little table map. <laughs> okay, good, good, good. Now we're free. To not melt in the ice. In the lights. Because it's just ordinary light. Keep going, little fishy. Apples and things in the distance. The human anatomy. Yeah, point. What's over here? <laughs> what are you hiding back here? Bread. <laughs> I can smell secret bread. Can you? I'll take it. Okay, and then we'll progress outwards. And we're probably going to be instrumental in saving this guy's life. I would imagine. We're probably going to... Somehow... We're not going to be inside someone to do the surgery, right? We're probably just going to knock the required item down off of a big high shelf. Who's there? You shouldn't be here. I'm practicing. Oh, you know. Sorry for interrupting in your practice. I'm trying to get into You're the vent. You're stopping vents. urgent surgery practice. I need to save lives. Don't interrupt my surgery. 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 <laughs> Is it... Have you got any Zydrate to help him with that surgery? I hear it gets you there. <laughs> I hear it takes you there. And then you're ready for that surgery. Surgery. Are you here for surgery? I, am I not. usually only operate on bobs, but I'll try my best. I am a fish. I am here to swim. Red. Red. <laughs> I get the distinct feeling I have taken a wrong turn. And I was probably supposed to run away from him. Emergency Every exit. Every second though. you keep hiding, Bob loses more blood. Bob will be fine. Okay, this is clearly the exit. I can see things behind it. This door actually is pushable. <laughs> the Arizona sunshine. Out of here, however. <laughs> El that's fine. <laughs> Copium. Everything's fine. Okay, the hot sun isn't melting us. That's ironic. Every second you waste, a Bob loses blood. Now, you probably want me to go that way. So I'm going to go this way. And explore. And probably be getting chased by that same guy still. <laughs> there he goes. Please don't hide. I must get back to my work. That's a vent. I see him coming. In the vent. In the vent. In the vent. Invention. It's not going to come I'm starting in here. to think you don't want surgery. What would make you think that? I'm a fish in ice. I don't need surgery. <laughs> Every second you keep hiding, Bob loses more blood. You seem to have had a bit of an accident there yourself. Remember to wash your hands. Like, what's up with your arm? Okay, this is a very thorough area. That's it. You follow me. I'll just lead you to doing the surgery on the Please guy. Please come out. Bob is in need of urgent surgery, and you're delaying that. You're getting in my way. Well, if you present it to me... I don't mind if I do. Don't run! What is making that noise? It sounds like 
something was melting us, but I don't think it was. Is it because you're watching me? Got away. Got away now. That looks like an ice bath. You are stopping urgent surgery practice. I need to save lives. Well, go practice then. You don't need to practice on me. Don't <laughs> run. I'm not. I'm sliding. All good. Fish can't run. We can roll. <laughs> we can slide. We can't run. I. You want to give me some legs? I can try. He's coming. Don't you He's want coming. surgery? I don't. <laughs> I'm good. Thanks. Bye. Radiators. Stay away. The blazing hot sun. Where are you? The reception. With remarkably few people waiting. Normally. That's a glass window. <laughs> I'm a fish. What do you mean you? How do you know who... Look. Okay, good. At least that had a window. Because <laughs> if that was not a window, we were going flying off the edge. Please and we're not a hide. flying fish. I must get back to my work. I'm not hiding. I'm slicing. Now that seems a little unfair. If you ask me. <laughs> I feel like... I... I feel like you're in love. No, we're not singing that song. <laughs> I feel I like that door here. was meant for us to hit it at surgery, high speed. You and my... Ice cube didn't look like it was that close to breaking, but maybe our time in the sun made it extra fragile. Because this is clearly blazing hot sun. No cars, no ambulance. Well, there's a car, okay. There are some stuff they haven't quite loaded in at the time. Right, I guess we need to impact the door a little slow. Hello, Anakim! Hello, hello! We are an ice cube. Come out. We're a little parada in an ice cube with a surgeon simulator surgeon chasing us because he wants to do surgery on us. For some reason. Even though we're a Fish ice cube. <laughs> Don't question it. <laughs> I'm sure it makes sense. And he's very determined to chase this fish ice cube. He wants to give it surgery. But it's fun slipping and sliding around. <laughs> and of course, adverts start immediately. <laughs> so I apologise if you get adverts. But I think you said that you don't, so it should be all good. Right. Oh. Well, we missed most of the ice cube section. We've got to transition to sink now. <laughs> From sink to sink. But it was a fun ice cube section for a while. Okay, so we're going to be swinging on some blood bags now. And swimming in blood. Maybe positive, <laughs> negative, volunteer donor, AB negative, whole blood. Perfect for vampires who must have whole blood. They can't have like semi skin blood. <laughs> which would that make own positive semi skins? In which case, I'm semi skins. <laughs> That was an interesting bounce you did there. Because I lack the AED part. I'm O, oh, which is empty. Okay. At least he can breathe blood. But I can't necessarily get that other bit. <laughs> so we will look for other sources of blood, because that one's too high. Perfect. <laughs> so all AB. Where's your O? O is more important than AB because most people can have it. Like O negative, everyone can have. But O positive, people that are positive can have. 
that own people can't have a B. Well, we are screwed. <laughs> if we need blood, we can only have O positive and O negative. At least it may be a little better than being O negative. <laughs> o negative, everyone in demand! But you can only have your own blood. Can't have any other, because positive will be bad for you. And also, A and B and AB will be bad for you. Come on. Fight this last bag. The bag, not the shelf. There we go. <laughs> right, time to find more blood. We're kind of making the place bleed a little. Perfect for vampires. Or oh, more AB again. No. No, oh. No, whoa, whoa. What is this place? Excuse me. Like. How much do I need to bite these blood bags? <laughs> there we go. I'm gonna say, I bit them. <laughs> Nothing coming out of them. Right. This should be a lot easier now, because we just win, right? We're gonna open every single drawer of all the bloods. <laughs> du -du 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 -du. Hello, Mary's Arts. I am gonna assume you're gonna say things that are probably not going to be good for you, so I would suggest <laughs> not. <laughs> for your own, if you want to be in chat and not get timed out by <laughs> saying dumb things. Just from the name, you know, just from the name, I would suggest not. <laughs> What do you mean? Oh, just the same thing that happens all the time and the people that are like, what do you mean? Oh no, I'm going to ask you. Mind if I ask you a question? Oh, what What? What do you mean? Uh, <laughs> it might it, it might be a perfectly nice and normal pe person, but there's so, it's a thing that's going around right now that is like the new scambot equivalent. And it is just, you know, a little much. <laughs> and I apologise if I'm tarnishing you in the bucket when you probably might not be. But, you know, just any sort of name like that now just immediately draws suspicion. You like the game? Good, good, good. You also watch this on your Facebook. Nice. It is a fun and interesting game. Right, we've flooded the whole place. Can I put the kettle on? <laughs> CONTAINER! Just some containers, no tea, no sugar, no coffee. Test tubes! Alright, time to get out of here. <laughs> We've bled this place dry. It's good that we are a vampire. Apparently, and we can <laughs> swim and breathe blood. Checkpoint. Laundry chutes. Right, I'm gonna go to the checkpoint, but then I'm gonna turn back around and go that way. Maybe you don't respect your viewers. Uh, maybe I don't want the same questions all the time, like people trying to sell the service who don't respect the streamer. <laughs> maybe I'm fed up with that. Well, this is interesting. It must be a glass window. I was going to say, <laughs> how is this not going in there? It's a glass window. Invisible glass, of course. <laughs> You was here the last 20 minutes. Well, you know, it's just a thing that happens a lot. And I, like I said, you know, it's happened too much. So, you know, if you're not here to sell services, then I appreciate you coming popping by, but... Container! We're probably going to go in one of those containers. It just happens too much lately, and it is the new thing on Twitch. And they don't respect the streamer. And because of their lack of respect... <laughs> Wassa coffee? You know, it, it induces this reaction from any sort of name with art graphics and things like that that are introducing in that manner. <laughs> Can... I absolutely can judge by name because 
of the way that it always is. <laughs> but I apologise if you are not, but it is just the way that it is. And it is an epidemic of annoyance lately on Twitch. And usually the first thing they say is, can I ask you a question? And the only reason I warned you is because saying that will get you automatically timed out by the bot. So I was doing you a kindness <laughs> in pointing out not to say, may I ask you a question or any derivative thereof. Because that would get you timed out. And I was being polite in even warning you. But, you know, if you want, I can just make sure not to warn anyone ever. <laughs> and then they can be banned of their own accord. And it is a rather lengthy timeout process of one to the e to the 12 millionth degree. <laughs> Bigger than numbers. It's the biggest number that you can possibly input in the timeout. <laughs> so, you know, I thought it would be nice to fair warn you. And that is... Um, yeah, very unacceptable language as well. Because that is anti-gender fluid. But, you know, yeah, sure, it is. If you want to consider it feminine hair, <laughs> it is hair that is acceptable for male and female. But, you know, if you are against non-binary haircuts and you are far right, then... Keep up your hate. May I say you something? That's another way of saying may I ask you a question, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, if you want to be a uh, hater, you know, that's your opinion. And your opinion is yours alone. Why can't I find any way out here? Like, the one thing that I can see is too high to grab. Like, there's a big old button up there. But in this shallow bit of bloods, we're certainly not jumping up there. Canister? Not the canister. Do, 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 do. How on earth do we do this? I mean, we found some extra breads. The bottom of this cabinet doesn't have a texture. <laughs> It's almost though you're not supposed to be in this shallow water. Because the bottom of that doesn't have a texture. Hmm. Maybe I can just push into the door. Um. Well. You get not accepted. And, you know, I will be... Thank you for being dumb. <laughs> oh, boom, 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 boom. Enjoy your ban. And enjoy probably getting banned off Twitch as well. Because, <laughs> you know, being like that and giving enough evidence to ban you and get you banned, you are dumb. <laughs> you didn't see uh, what got denied there, Anna Kim. She said some really dumb shit that... <laughs> really dumb shit that is auto-modded. And, you know, if it gets auto-modded, that is good enough to report and get them banned off Twitch. <laughs> so, if they're that dumb to put stuff that gets auto-modded, then they're welcome to their ban off of Twitch permanently. <laughs> as well as getting banned from chat. And they were also probably a bot anyway. Now, why am I not able to do anything in here. Hmm. Any ideas? <laughs> I'm a little stuck. And I'm not seeing anything. Unless... 
A laundry door doesn't open. Laundry definitely doesn't open. What if I come back in here? I mean, none of the blood is refilled. <laughs> so somehow I need to flood this whole room up to a bigger standard. I mean, coffee guy points this way. Maybe that's helpful. Part of me thinks I need to be in a container and container contains liquid. <laughs> but I might be wrong. But yeah, like, <laughs> if they're that dumb to do something like that, then they get what they deserve. Oh! I bounce into that door. Coffee man is running away. Coffee man runs this way. And take the mop. There's something off about this door. Aha! <laughs> we found something. Ha. Perfect. Something we can nibble. Nibble it. Okay, this will be sure to flood the place. Probably. Okay, with even more blood. Now, that scene plaster <laughs> would say to me that the thing might be getting cemented, but let's not question it. Okay, now I probably can get back in the containers. Or at least I can push this button on the door. And then we probably want to go into one of those buckets. I was half thinking maybe I need to be in one of those buckets beforehand. Can I move the laundry bucket through water? No. <laughs> okay, there goes that plan. Part of me thinks there's probably some bread that I've missed, but I'm going to ignore it. Because if we go up the elevator, this is just going to flood out the instant we hit a floor. What the? Well. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> he obviously got better. To the ocean. In the sewer. <laughs> We're very lucky. Very lucky that that blood landed us perfectly in there. Now that guy should have maybe got flooded with us. <laughs> if you ask me, ooh, more water or more blood. More blood for the banana. Floods with blood. To the ocean! We probably made it. <laughs> And now that's all the fish to the ocean. Du -du -du. No more ice, but who knows? Maybe more ice. <laughs> it's a very long tunnel, so it's got to be all the way to the ocean, right? We did it! Only four respawns. Four stars. And almost all the breads. Okay, we got them all to the ocean. Reunite the four fish rats. Here he is. The greedy one. <laughs> da -da -da -da. And a fifth fish, friends? The wide open sea. But no more breads. Dolphins leading the way. Lots of colourful fish.
But they don't seem to like us much. Oh no. <laughs> and immediately recaptured. Finale! Okay, I was like, where do I go? <laughs> Finale, the aquarium. Okay, let's all escape again together? Probably I change between fish. <laughs> In one whole big level. Utilizing all of their powers combined! But how? Because, you know, flying fish would just fly away. <laughs> Maybe I do need to get them all there individually. 